Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hey, what's up? My name is Caitlin, and this is a channel where we talk all things toys and dolls. Today, we're back with another Monster High doll review. We're going to be talking about Scared Ice Island Heath Burns today. This is Heath's signature doll, so kind of sucks that we get him in a budget line, but it is what it is, I guess. Um, his outfit is cute. I would prefer to have, like, actual clothing from, like, the show. Which now that I think about it, I can't even remember what he wears. Maybe this is what he wears. I, I don't know. <laughs> if it is, ignore everything I just said. But he's got three accessories as well. He looks super cute. I really love his hair. We will get to that. Here's his artwork, making him look super cheesy and cute. It says Heath Burn, Scared Ice Island. Here he is on the back with the three ghouls. Um, Laguna is still missing. Here is the... Uh, a little detail that I love, which is the coconuts looking like skulls. <laughs> and then, does this say the same thing? Nabuku is ready for a relaxing getaway on Scared Ice Island. Yeah, this says the same thing as the one I read yesterday, so I'm not going to read this again. But here it is if you want to read it. Okay, I'm going to get Heath out, and we'll be right back. And we are back. So a few accessories. He does have a bag that's blue with a little faux zipper and flames at the bottom. You can put some stuff in there. Then he has some orange sunglasses that have flames on the sides. Cute. We have a little SPF 30, is that what it says? Yeah, 30 SPF, so drastically different than uh, Draculaura's from yesterday's video. Makes sense though, he is like a heat monster thing. Um, and then finally we have his cup that looks like a volcano, which I think is super cute. I really like his drink. Okay. Now for Mr. Heath. Let's do him out a little bit. He's super fun. I really love his hair. It's like in the shape of a mohawk that's flaming. And then the red sides. It is all like molded. Like there's no actual hair, but it makes sense for him to have molded hair, I guess, and I don't mind it. His face is really cute. I think the shape of his eyes are kind of weird. I don't mind them. And then he does look like he is wearing a like brownish red lipstick. Outfit wise, it feels not the best. <laughs> He's definitely wearing swimming trunks, which is fine. It makes sense. They're on a beach. And they have flames that match his hoodie. Um, he does have a hood, which makes zero sense in my mind. So let's see if I can get him to wear the hood. Oh, I hate it when they do that. Like, it's... Okay, I'll show you. Yeah, he can wear the hood. It looks ridiculous, but he can wear it. But it's cut out in the back. I hate that. I don't know why. And it makes sense, because if you want to put it on, like, one of the ghouls and they have long hair, then it can go out the back. But... I don't know. I don't like that. <laughs> and then his shoes are just basic slides with blue. The slides are blue and then they have flames on the bottom. So that's Heath. That's really it for Heath. Um, I do think he's really cute. I like him a lot. He's not my favorite monster, but I don't dislike him by any means. I think he's cute. Okay. Let me know down below who your favorite G3 monster is and which one you want to see. Like, I really like the monsters, so I'm excited we're getting more of them with Heath here. I, of course, really want to see Porter. <laughs> and I would love to see uh, Skunkertes, was that his name? The new character, the skunk guy, the wear skunk from the show. Skunkertes? I don't remember, but I want one of him very badly. I don't know if we'll ever get it, but I want it. So, yeah, let me know who you want down below. And that's everything, so don't forget to like this video before you go. Subscribe so you don't miss out on any more of my future videos, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.